Hello, this is a video on the so-called prosperity gospel. It is a last day gospel that has spread like wildfire from America to all corners of the world. The proponents of prosperity gospel are people who are respected in the church. They have large following. They command large crowds in stadiums all over the world, in auditoriums all over the world. It is a gospel that suits people because it is a convenience gospel. It talks about prosperity. People are tricked that when they sow large amounts of seed, they will enjoy supernatural transfer of wealth. Money will come into their bank accounts. In fact, if they sow seed, they are told, their debt will be cancelled. Mortgage debt, credit card debt, and student loans will be cancelled. It's a gospel that doesn't talk about salvation. It doesn't preach about judgment. It is a gospel that let people lay back at the time when the final trumpet of heaven has sounded. It is a gospel that let people go asleep without caring about the imminent danger. The danger of de judgment, God's judgment that is coming. Jesus has warned us in Matthew chapter 24 verse 4 that let no man deceive you. In the last days, Satan has commissioned men who know the Bible, but they are abusing the Bible. They are distorting scriptures. Prosperity gospel is not based upon any scripture in the Old Testament or in the New Testament. It is a scheme, it's a fraud. And those preaching gospel, prosperity gospel know that it's a fraud. It's, it is a way of getting money from people. Stay away from prosperity gospel. Uh, you have heard that Pastor Benihin has come out to denounce the prosperity gospel. It is a theology that he invented. It is a fraudulent theology. It is a hell theology. Theology that takes people to hell. Paul, Peter, James and John, they suffered from poverty. They suffered from the prisons. And they suffered persecution. The Lord has warned us that we have to work our salvation with fear and trembling. The Lord also has told us that we need to suffer for his name's sake. There's nothing like prosperity in the scripture about salvation. We have to work our salvation with fear and trembling. In fact, in the days of tribulation, people will suffer. Their prosperity will suffer. We have to be aware of the false doctrines of the last days and prosperity gospel is one of them. 
Hello, this is Messiah Revelation Ministry. My name is Charles Quatin. Thank you very much.